And there are some people that would say, in Matthew 8, it says he did what he did so that Isaiah 53 would be fulfilled. And they say, so we can't count that for today because that was already fulfilled back then. So if that's true, then none of us could be saved because none of us were there whenever he was crucified. But the fact that he was crucified fulfilling scripture means that today we can partake of his sacrifice without having to have been there physically, personally. So if you look at the Hebrew and, and Greek of this passage, it is clear that physical healing was provided by the passion of Christ or the sacrifice of Christ. Everything Jesus did was on credit of what was going to happen. Let me put it this way. If when Jesus went to Pilate, Pilate said, have him whipped, but that's enough. So he had him whipped. What if Pilate had said, that's enough. I'm not going to crucify him. Then you could have had physical healing, but you couldn't be saved. Because the stripes, the whipping bought your healing. But if his blood had not been shed on the cross for our sin, we couldn't be saved today. But now you have to realize that he did both. So both were paid for.